Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. For today's video, we're going to guide all of you through the process of changing the language in your GoDaddy account. This can be useful if, if you prefer to navigate GoDaddy's interface in a language other than the, the default, especially if you're using a VPN. But before we dive in, make sure you hit that subscribe button below and ring the notification bell. So you never miss out on our latest content. Okay, before we get started, you have to go to your website or probably uh, the browser of your choice. I'm sorry. I'm using Google Chrome right now. And then go to uh, godaddy.com. Create an account. And once you are successful, log in using your credential. Okay, once you are logged in, you will be seeing the dashboard. And then, once you're on the dashboard, uh, changing the language settings in your GoDaddy can be done for a lot of reasons, uh, depending on your preferences and needs. Okay, the most straightforward reason is that if you are more comfortable navigating and interacting with websites and services in language, other what's in the default, right? So changing that to your preferred one can make your GoDaddy experience more user friendly and if you manage a website or online business with a global audience changing the language can help help ensure that your content emails and communications are presented in a way that your inter international audience can understand and engage with right or also if you have a team that collaborates on your godaddy account and team members speaks different languages changing the language settings to accommodate various team members can enhance collaboration and understanding also, before I forgot, for businesses or websites that serve um, specific regions or countries, using the local language can make your content and offerings more relatable and appealing to the local audience. Okay, so how do we do that? Here, go to the interface itself. You have to go to the account management help and changing the language for my GoDaddy account, all right? You have to click this uh, hyperlink here, main GoDaddy page, scroll down to the footer and click the current country and language. When you click that, you will be directed here on its interface, right? GoDaddy.com. Uh, and all you got to do is go down and hover below where you can find the language right here. It also have, beside that is the currency. You can also uh, change the currency if you wanted. And you can change um, the language of your country or region that you are comfortable. And once you've done that, If you're able to um, change your language, now web developers and marketers, if they change the language, you can see how content or websites appear in different languages for testing and marketing purposes. Remember, changing the language in GoDaddy can be a very simple process, right? It's a walk in the park, but it can significantly improve your experience with the platform and cater to the language preferences of both you and your audience, especially if you have an e-commerce business and it's like global, it has a global audience, it really is helpful. Because sometimes, you know, language settings are accidentally set to the wrong language during the initial setup. So changing that is necessary to correct the error. And for also for um, educational purposes, you might want to change the language to learn more about how the platform works in different languages especially if you're studying web hosting or domain management and once again guys if you find this video helpful please do not forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more useful tips and tutorials thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one before i for before i let you go guys I just wanted to um, take a moment to express my gratitude to each and every one of you who has been part of our Easy Earl community. Your support means the world to us. I can't thank you enough. See you in the next video.